Hello, this is my new app, Sunvirus Adapter. Adapter. This is a uh, use it to um, allow Iris apps using uh, use Samba uh, protocol. Samba protocol is a, a interoperability um, technology that allows you uh, access, um, save, download, upload files into um, remote folders in the company so I, I can map a folder in a server uh, and access this folder through uh, any computer in the network uh, and these computers can be Linux, Windows, any uh, operating system that supporting Samba. Okay, so uh, it's like FTP, but uh, Samba is more uh, integrated with file systems in Windows and Linux. So I, I created an interoperability uh, production to allow uh, any uh, application use uh, Samba to um, post files, uh, list files in remote folders. So to use this app, we need to clone. Okay, I will clone. And we got to test Samba. Let me cut the same tests. CD Samba tests. Beat clone. I will use um, VS Code to run the app, edit, see the files of the projects. Okay. Codes, dots. I will trust. Now I will open terminal to execute a Docker. Docker compose builds. That will build this to uh, image services uh, services. Samba is a um, Samba server to store uh, files, and I server is the production. Now, Docker Compose up. Share and now uh, we have uh, Iris and in this part. I will access the call. Okay, system says mm, user namespace. Um, I need to set credentials. Send credentials with the username and password for this remote Samba server. Okay, um, you can see this here. User Bob uh, password Bob. Bob spells WD save now I need to open and run 
Ensemble production. We have uh, uh, in this production functionalities to create files, create folders, remote, uh, remote files, remote folders, delete folders, download files, and list files inside a folder. Um, and these folders are remote in any server supporting Simba, like FTP. And then we have a, a Samba business operation to do interaction uh, with Samba. So I receive a file and use Samba business operation to send the file to a Samba server. Okay. Samba server name in, the, in this port, uh, accessing this uh, share. Bob Drive, share Bob Drive. Okay. Now we'll test the app. I have a, a I have in this app um, API API Samba API to to uh, do the uh, front end for my uh, prediction so this api will um, execute production uh, functionalities business services in productions um, i will create folder create folder um, Execute server create for the servers. Okay, and uh, we will execute it now. The create folder. So requests. I can see the, the functionalities in my app here. Create folder. LP posts. Instances, body, uh, whole, JSON, JSON, folder name, uh, Simba folder, the name of the uh, folder, Samba folder is a new folder in the server, Samba server. I will sense, okay, uh, I can see, I can see the new folder inside Docker. Samba server MEMT to Samba folder empty folder for now. And now I will create file inside create file. Um, I need to do a form data. Um, select file, write file here, and select any file. I will select a cat. OK. 
okay file cats create file insides uh, samba folder samba open okay posts okay great sends file save it and now Samba folder has a cat image. I will get this file. Uh, download. Download. Download file. Post. Download file posts. Okay. Download file. Uh, well, JSON. Samba. Folder. Samba folder. Okay. Got a uh, cats from my Samba server, from a remote server. Okay, very good. Uh, I can list files inside this folder. So, uh, to do this, go to list files. this folder cats jpeg okay so um, using my, my um, interoperability uh, production you uh, do anything in sample folders in remote folders in your network uh, corporate uh, network folders I can see the messages here. Uh, create file uh, or list. You can see I uh, my service received from the API um, the requests for some web folder. And return it a list of Samba files. Okay, very good. No, yes. So, this is my app. Uh, enjoy it.